Hey everyone, just going to show you how to change Death Stranding on a Mac so that it takes advantage of the 16 by 10 aspect ratio of your Mac. So if you have a MacBook Pro or MacBook Air or something like that, and you want to display the full resolution of the game, take advantage of the vertical pixel height, then we can apply this fix, which basically takes the screen from 16 by 9 to 16 by 10. So it's going to show you how to do that now. So basically we have to navigate to the Death Stranding Director's Cut uh, local library containers folder and basically the way that you get to there is you open up a new finder window and then what we're going to do is to hold down the option key press go and then this reveals this library folder here just click on that and then what we're going to do is to go to containers double click and then we're going to find our death stranding directors cut folder here and then double click on this and then within the data folder we're going to find a settings.cfg. So control click on this and then click open with and then text edit. That's going to take us to the text edit file here. So what we want to do is to change the rendering height and width. So I'm not sure what it says on your screen, but you can basically calculate a 16 by 10 aspect ratio instead of a 16 by 9. And uh, basically we're going to be using on this MacBook Air with the M1 chip. I'm going to change this to uh, vertical resolution of 1200 zero, zero, and that takes us from 16 by 9 to 16 by 10. So click on file and then save and now that's saved. So basically we're going to go and open up Death Stranding by going into applications, double click on Death Stranding and we're signing into the game now. And now we have that vertical height so it's taken us all the way up. So if this had a notch it would go under the notch but basically we're filling up the screen now. So that is how you go ahead and change the Death Stranding on Mac from 16.9 to 16.10. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.